La 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 do do do. Pearly is in the park. Magic in the city. Over the rainbow at the end of the street is Jubilee Park, where the fairies meet. Away from traffic in the neon scene, doing the magic, keeping it green. Fairies, elves, goblins too. You can't see us, but we see you. So watch your step with your purse and feet. Over the rainbow at the end of the street. Now twinkle, now sparkle, now glimmer, glimmer, shine. Shoelaces. Correction, 17 self tying shoelaces. <laughs> Atta girl, Pearly. That wasn't me. The burp came out of this box, truly. Four burp boxes. Well, thanks for assisting me with my inventory. You've been more help than an anteater at a pixie picnic. Oh, it's no trouble at all, Aunt Garnet. Whoa! Oh, this rocks! And it's comfy, too. All natural fibers, man. You look snug as a bug on that rug, Jasper. But we've got work to do. Whoa! Here, chuck this in the recycling bin. Don't throw that out. That's my delivery hotline. But it doesn't have a string. We've gone wireless. Hello? Great Aunt Garnet's Emporium of Enchantments. <laughs> Oh, my dear, a thousand apologies. Yes, certainly, right away. Where is Wizard? I simply can't keep my clients waiting. What's taking him so long with that last delivery? Higher, uh, higher, uh -huh. uh, lower, uh, lower, uh, uh, higher. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Be gosh and Bagora, the leprechauns need this delivery. I'll have to take it there myself. Are you able to carry on without me? Of course. Don't worry about a thing. Cheerio, then. I'll be back before you can say shala... Sh Shalali? Exactly. Toodaloo. Huh? Hold on. What's this? It's a snow globe. <laughs> cool. Interesting. <laughs> nice. There's a note on the bottom. Tis a grave mistake to let him escape. <laughs> Who? That itty bitty snowman. Let's see here. Jasper. Let's get a little snow at him. <laughs> oh, 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 no. Whoa. Oh, God, it's going to be cheesed off. Hey, just use your wand to put it back together, Pearly. If I can. All right, I'll give it a try. Here goes. Wait, here's another. Jasper. <laughs> Opal? Jasper? Yeah! Crikey! I did it! I did! We're inside the snow globe! Yeah! Oh, get you out! <laughs> I can see right up Pearly's nose. Jasper! Don't worry! I'll get you out! What did she say? i have net new snout? You got me, mate. Now, where do you reckon that snowman's got to? Oh, dear, oh, dear. I've got to get them out. <laughs> Roots and twigs. I've run out of fizzle. Ah! Pearly! Ah! <laughs> Pearly! <laughs> Jubilee Park! Emergency! I've got my hands full here, Wizard. But there's a... Please, Wizard, you're distracting me. There's a monster in the park! <gasps> oh, no. Why didn't you say so? Hang on. Wait. <laughs> there, monster footprints. Oh. Snow? In the middle of summer? Early. Sapphira! Early. Frost all 
over my windows. I can't see a thing. Scrape it off, Ludwig. But it's so cold, mistress. Yes, yes, life is hard, isn't it? Now get scraping. <laughs> yes, mistress. Pearly, what's happening? My hot tubs are skating rinks. My sauna's an ice cave. Fix it now. <laughs> <laughs> No, oh, mistress, did you hurt your most precious hindquarters? Quick, everyone, inside! Man, this is better than a bouncy castle. Uh oh. Oh, do not be afraid, mistress. I'm here to protect you. Afraid? I'm not afraid. I was just looking for something back here. Pearly, what is that thing? Hurley, Burly, it's a snowman. A what? It's the snowman from the snow globe. Woo. I was trying to fix this, but everything went wrong, and I put Opal and Jasper inside and zapped the snowman here. So it is your fault. I knew it. Yes, and I am so sorry, everyone. This is just dreadful. He'll freeze the whole park. The birds will fly south. The leaves will fall off the trees. The flowers will shrivel. And what will persons think? Oh, this is terrible. <gasps> Great Aunt Garnet should be back by now. She'll know what to do. I'll get her. Good luck, Pearly. That big brute is your responsibility, cousin. You have to get rid of him. Hmm. I'm not sure how to do that without my wand. Maybe if I just talk to him? Oh, yes, talk to him. I'm sure he's perfectly reasonable for a giant, angry, rampaging snowman, that is. You're right. I'll give it a try. I'm sure you'll make a lovely pink pint-sized popsicle. Really, mistress? When the Grand Fairy Federation sees Jubilee Park covered in snow, they'll put Pearly in the deep freeze permanently. This is perfect, and I didn't have to do a thing. <laughs> what do you think you're doing? I'm uh, blowing on your hands to warm them, uh, most exalted one. <sighs> You gotta keep moving, man, or you'll be solid ice. Jump on board and let's start carving. Wow! Okay, Pearly, be brave. Park Fairy, uh, and you are... <laughs> oh, right. Well, here's the thing. I'm the one to blame for you being here, and I'm really, really sorry. my wand to keep my foot bath warm. <sighs> Come mm. on, hurry up, recharge. Oh, it's like the North Pole out there. Poor bye freezing bye creatures. Bye and good night. Ludwig, give me that blanket. Shoo, shoo. Excuse me. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that tickles. <laughs> Oh. 
What? Oh, finally. Sunshine. This will warm the place up. La la la. Do do do. It'll melt you, too. Excellent! We're powered up! <clears throat> Hello again! I bet you'd like to go back home right about now. Am I right? I can help, but we have to do it quick before you melt. Just touch the glass. Oh, hold on. I almost forgot something. <laughs> Scrag, Mr. Flea. <laughs> Drop the carrot. Right. Here we go. Whoa! Oh, thank goodness. Are you two all right? No worries. We're fine. That globe's got Wicked powder! Top of the morning, Curly! Those leprechauns really know how to paint the town green. Oh, Leaf Garnet, I made such a mess of everything. I was trying to fix the... No good crying over spilt fairy dust, my dear. No harm done. Anywho, it's wonderful for him to go on a rampage now and then. Marvelous exercise. Are your bugs and critters in the park all thawed out? Everyone's fine. I told them to warm up at Sapphira Spa. This is not a zoo. Now out you go, little ducky. Out, out, nasty possum. <laughs> ah! Ludwig! Mistress! <laughs> Ow! Ow! Crikey, Jasper, how did you get these thorns in you? Don't ask. Let's just say it involved a lack of water. Ow! Harley Burley! Jubilee Park is going to be in the prettiest park edition of the Morning Myth! Struth, that's a serious honor! I know! <laughs> Everything must be perfect. I'll start with the flower beds. The reporter is coming this afternoon! This afternoon! This afternoon! This afternoon! A Morning Myth reporter is coming to Jubilee Park. Fabulous. Wonderful news, mistress. Not exactly. They're coming to do a story about the dreary gardens for the prettiest park edition. Terrible news, mistress. But if the gardens are a mess, he'll have to find something else to write about, won't he? Oh, perhaps the pigeons, huh? The most beautiful thing in Jubilee Park is my fabulous spa. Hold the front page. Ooh. Everything has to be tickety-boo for the reporter. <gasps> Roots and twigs. Look. They're messier than a bandicoot dragged through a billabong backwards. I'll just give them a quick spruce up. Huh? Oh, no. My wand has lost its fizzle. Mate, I told you not to change the color of the rotunda 79 times last night. Oh. Jasper, you'll have to speak to the flowers. Please ask them to smarten up. Me? <laughs> no way. I, I promised to synchronize the duck swimming. Ciao. Jasper, come back. I guess I'd better wait until my wand recharges. I don't think you've got enough time. The reporter will be here soon. Hmm, let's see if Aunt Garnet can help. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh. here it is. Elf's own flower power potion for elves who want to talk to plants but have lost their voices. Or fairies who want to be elves. You just spray it on, eh? Voila! The plant will be able to hear you. Wow! Your store has everything. But I must warn you, spray only the teeny tiniest little puff on the leaves. Perfect. Thanks, Aunt Garnet. And be careful what you say around flowers. They can be a sensitive bunch. Hurley. Burly, this is exciting! Here goes. Good morning, Miss Rose. Could you open your gorgeous blooms, please? It doesn't seem to hear you. I'll spray it a little more. <coughs> oh, 
I beg your pardon? <gasps> What's that ghastly muck you've just sprayed on me? Oh, my goodness. You can talk. <laughs> and move. This is awesome. Go on. Spray some more. Ripper. <laughs> 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 oh, how fun. The fairy wants to talk to us. And here comes that incompetent elf. Whoa, dudes, the flowers are talking. What have you done? Isn't it wonderful? Now I can tell them exactly what I want them to do. We don't take orders from <laughs> fairies. So go away. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there's no need to be rude. Don't look at me. I never told you what flowers are like because I didn't want to ruin their image. But flowers can be really mean. Ow! Oh, I already told you I was sorry. I won't forget to water you ever again. Ha! Silly tea cozy head. <laughs> <laughs> Using magic to make oh. flowers talk? That must be against the rules. I do hope the reporter from the Morning Myth doesn't find out. <laughs> Ow! Of course, it could be worse if flowers started talking to persons. Oh, no. I hadn't thought of that. Thanks, Sapphira. We better go ask the flowers to behave. Good luck, darling! Believe me, she'll need it. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you, you common weed! You think you're so much better than the rest of us. Please, be nice. No way! You Come tell her! her. She <laughs> stuck up! <laughs> Shh! Family of Persons is coming. I hope they don't come over here and smell me. Yoo-hoo! The rose is over here! No, no, Bring no! Bring your no. scissors! So, just for this afternoon, if you could... Chill. <laughs> <laughs> Move out! Outrageous! I'm going to give those persons a piece of my mind! No! <laughs> Why are the violets crying? What did you say to them? Who cares? They're crybabies! How's it going? <sighs> the reporter's gonna be here soon. Man, that sunflower has serious issues. But he's agreed to keep it down for now. I told the violets a bedtime story. They're having a nap. How did you get the roses and daisies to stop fighting? I bribed them with a bag of mulch. Who knew flowers could be so difficult? Oh, we should be fine, so long as nothing sets them off again. <laughs> Come on, Ludwig. Let's have a word with the flowers. Yes, mistress. Uh... Oh! I heard that. Pearly has ordered the snails to come and chew your leaves. What? Pearly's going to plant thistles in your flower bed. Boulder She's invited a bunch of persons to pick you for a bouquet. <laughs> <laughs> she wouldn't dare. I'm not going to take that. Can you see how angry I am? Is that what I think it is? It sounds floral, dude. Crikey. Let's go see. Jasper! Listen to that. Music to my ears. La, 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 la. Please, if you just stay nice and quiet, you're sure to get in the prettiest park edition of the paper. How insensitive! Newspapers are made out of poor, innocent trees. You wood chipper! Snail lover! Bad brain! Dirty pants! <laughs> Oh, go away! How dare you? You are a butcher. No, you're worse than a butcher. You're a florist! A sting! <laughs> oh no, now they're really upset. Ow! I definitely got out of the wrong side of the flower bed this morning. Now, calm down. You're here to help. <laughs> Whoa, dudes! <laughs> Something's made those flowers crankier than a kangaroo with a sore tail. Who are you calling a beanstalk? Oh, you'll be feeling my thorns soon. Blossy blossom! Oh. Now they're fighting each other. <laughs> if the reporter writes about this, I'm gonna be in so much trouble with Fairy HQ. <gasps> We need 
help. Oh, dear. You used the lot? Yes, I'm sorry. Ow! Angry plants can cause serious injuries. Ugh. Do you have anything to make the flowers behave themselves? I thought you wanted to talk to the flowers. Please, Aunt Garnet, an antidote or a silencing formula or some kind of stunning spell? You got yourself into this pickle, Pearly, and you'll have to de-pickle it. I'd hope for a soaking if I were you. <sighs> hope for a soaking? What does that mean? Do I need a bath or something? Probably, but that's not what Aunt Garnet meant. She means we need a rain shower. Rain will wash the potion off and make the plants go quiet. Hey, I've got it. We can make our own rainstorm. Come on. Everybody, push. Oh. Welcome to Jubilee Park. Unfortunately, Pearly has a prior engagement. Would you like to start with my lovely spa? Or perhaps hearing my life story? I was always a shy fairy. Actually, I can't wait to see the flower beds. I've heard so much about them. <sighs> and he'll hear so much from them any moment now. <laughs> yes! Ready, Jasper? Ready, Pearly. Roses, prepare to be doused. <laughs> <laughs> So after you've seen the flower bedlam, whoops, I mean beds, remember, you're welcome to take a few snapshots of moi and my gorgeous spa. Hey, no, 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 Will you listen up. Okay. What's that noise? Pardon? <clears throat> it's your camera ready, Sid. I smell a story here. Riot in the rose bed. Daisy disaster. These flowers are sensational! So, you think we'll still be in the prettiest park edition? Pearly, Jubilee Park will make the cover! Pearly, Pearly! Typical, you both headed blooms! <gasps> <gasps> Mistress! Unhand me, you infernal flowering fool! Thanks, Pearly. We've got everything we need. Come back soon. I wonder where the flowers are taking Sapphira. Hmm. They say they're taking her to visit their cousin Ivy. Poison Ivy. Ah! Ludovic! Oh, 